acquittal in the Sean Bell case. Reverend Wright goes prime time and Mariah's on top again. Hey, I'm Callie and this is a mobile news break. The verdict in the Sean Bell case is not guilty. Three New York City police officers were found innocent on all charges by a state Supreme Court judge. This is in the death of 23 year old Sean Bell who was killed by a stream of 50 bullets hours before his wedding. As much as the Obama campaign wanted the Reverend Wright issue to be over, it's back in the spotlight thanks to the Reverend himself. Wright shares his side of the story in an interview with Bill Moyer, which airs tonight on PBS. Plus, he'll be speaking at the National Press Club in D.C. on Monday. Meanwhile, Senator McCain accuses North Carolina's Republican Party of being out of touch. That's because he asked them to pull an ad which criticizes Obama, and they refused. Pole vaulting went from track and field to the shopping mall this week. About 3,000 spectators packed this mall in Des Moines, Iowa to watch. Mariah Carey is at the top again. Her new album, E Equals MC Square, debuted at the top of the charts. It sold almost half a million copies during its first week in stores, making it Carey's biggest sales week ever. Finally, happy century to Edward R. Murrow. Today would have been the CBS News legend's 100th birthday. So on that note, good day and good luck.